Chatterbox is here with George Comanche, an undefeated middleweight. We're here at the WBC convention. George, first of all, can you tell the fans how to pronounce your last name? Well, my name is Comanche Boy George Tatanipa. I'm the WBC Continental America's middleweight champion. 28 no, 21 knockouts, undiscovered. Come from the southern plains of Oklahoma, Comanche native. And um, I'm here to get an award for diabetes out in the communities and working for prevention for my, my people, my tribe, and all Native Americans and all people out in America. Perfect. I could have said it better myself. Now, George, um, are you thinking of uh, fighting in February? What are your plans? Um, I'm recovering from an injury right now that I sustained in July, so I had to take a little time off to heal. But um, I'm looking to come back at the end of February. Uh, the venue is undecided, but it will be out there on ComancheBoy.com first thing as soon as we find out. And then um, just a tune-up fight, then after that it's time to get worldwide recognition. You know, 2012 is my year to get recognized. Now, I know that you have a huge fan following in your local area. Can you tell people who haven't seen your walkout entrance what it all entails? Oh, uh, my entrance is, uh, is the greatest in the world. <laughs> it's, um, you know, if you've never seen the Native American culture, you need to come watch one of my fights. And my whole objective is to fight on HBO, to, to get introduced to the ring. And when I come to the ring, you're going to hear the drum beating. You're gonna, I'm going to have a Native American drum there. And you're going to see uh, two Native American war dancers go out there, do their dance, and then I'm going to be wrapped out by Native American rappers, my family members, and we'll come in the ring and I'm going to do my thing and uh, conquer and destroy. That sounds incredible. So in your weight division, what are some of the names that you would love to fight in the future? Um, Julio Cesar Chavez Jr., Sergio Martinez, um, anybody at the top. You know, and, and it's professional boxing, it's about making money. and. Um, and I'm, I'm, I'm to provide for my family, and I, I'm a fighter, I'm a warrior, I'm going to do my thing, and I'm destined to come out there and be discovered for my, my people and my race. Great, and one last question. You're representing the 49th Annual WBC Convention in Las Vegas. What are your thoughts of all this activity and craziness and fun and excitement? Yeah, it's overwhelming. You know, you uh, grow up watching Mike Tyson on TV, Evander Holyfield, uh, Ricky Hatton, you know, uh, and now I'm in the same room sharing, uh, uh, breathing the same air as him. So it's uh, it's humbling. It makes me say, hey, I'm, I'm, I'm coming up. I'm uh, walking the same floor as him. So now it's it's my time to go make a name just like they did. Thank you, Kamunch boy. Good luck with the future. Thank you.